Most people don't think of a bond as a credit product. They think of it as an insurance product, which it is. But many times bonds require financial qualification, which means you got to show me your financials. The reason that is, is because a bond is essentially an extension of credit, whether it's a $10,000 license bond or it's a $10 million performance or payment bond. A surety company is partnering with you, providing somebody else a guarantee that you're going to perform. If that performance means the registrar of contractors in Arizona or in California or Texas or wherever a license bond for an auto dealer might be required, the federal government, when you're providing those license and permit bonds, you're agreeing to perform according to statutes that were set forth by the person requiring that bond, the state or federal government. When you don't and somebody makes a claim that you're not, that bond is there as a form of credit to pay on your behalf. You have that bond to guarantee that you're going to adhere to statutes and performance obligations, whoever you're licensed with. That's a small example, but it still is a credit. And lots of times, just like with credit cards or whatever it might be, small credit applications don't require financials. But I promise you, if you go and get a $10 million line of credit or loan or home loan, they're going to want to see a bank statement or a financial statement if it's for a company. Same thing with bonding. If you're going to get into larger amounts, I'd say anything under a million, we can base on credit alone, just like a credit card. But once you start getting above that or the job complexity increases or you have multiple small bonds, if you have five $200,000 jobs or you have 10 $400,000 jobs, you're going to have to provide financial qualification. That means a balance sheet, income statement, depending how big it is, a CPA may need to get involved to give another layer of security to that surety company that the numbers that you're presenting are accurate and honest. Those are all things as the complexity of your company and the complexity of the jobs are getting larger that you're going to need to provide uh, financial assurances. So financial statements are required from contractors and other companies when bond requirements get larger.